Hello guys, so in uh, this video I will explain uh, to you uh, my uh, last task on my paper that I am working on and uh, about uh, the, the hardware startup failure and how we collect uh, the data and how we monitorizing uh, the data and uh, what I did uh, differently on this uh, issue. So let's go to the scene number two. So um, I start uh, thinking uh, we have in the research uh, paper that uh, given to me by Professor Xiao, my supervisor, that uh, the, there's um, the two, two researcher if they agree that uh, the information monitoring of the data collection is useful and it is useful otherwise if there is a conflict between the two researchers there is a third party researcher he will judge with what, whether if or if not this information is useful so to solve uh, this conflict I uh, I think uh, with my uh, I say it with myself you know I take some time to think instead of uh, making conflict between the researcher or between human you know and to 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 not let our emotion affect our decision and let it, uh, make it more rational I try thinking about to create uh, some kind of algorithm or build a model to solve this such kind of uh, of uh, conflict okay so going uh, <coughs> Uh, the, my supervisor sent me the data and uh, these data they are the, uh, about a, a company uh, they make uh, a hardware startup and this hardware startup are failing are failing and then they uh, they publish um, the description why this uh, the, the, the description of this hardware such as robotics such as uh, battery uh, etc etc and they explain in this description and we have to find out from this description a useful information we have to monitorize this inf uh, information from this com uh, company description to find uh, whether uh, these information are useful or not in the same uh, uh, we have a website uh, that uh, publish this kind of data it's near one minute. So. so we have a website, uh, web, uh, 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 CB Insights. So they publish two twenty reasons why the the uh, so this uh, company are fail. Top twenty reason. So from this one, top twenty reason. I have to read. Uh, I not. I have. I did read this description one by one manually. I went to the website, and then I I put. Uh, let me go here. Yes. So these are the 20 reasons why these uh, companies fail. So I, I read the description and I have to figure out whether it's the failure is uh, number 20, failure of uh, failure to uh, pivot when necessary, or number 19, or, or, or. So I decide to print a code for each failure. I read the description and find out why this hardware, why this robot, for example, is failed. So I found that is uh, the reason there is, for example, no fund. The CEO of the of the robotic uh, company or Lenovo company or whatever company they say is, we have a poor marketing. So I put the code of the failure. Okay. Then after that, if there is a reason, uh, if uh, if uh, if I uh, if in the description satisfy at least one reason of these 20 then 
the information that uh, I have I have gotten from the description it will be useful now in uh, in uh, why this is uh, uh, important why lean in the startup and the hardware startup or software startup is important because uh, we are living not in 1960 we are living in 2021 so for example if uh, in 1960 if IBM or uh, any hardware company uh, face a bug it is no problem that they took a long time to solve this, uh, the, the bug problem even at the 60 there is a cold war and they need to be lean they have to be fast to solve the problem uh, fast but now in 2020 uh, the time to recover or to solve the box or to solve the security issue need to be lean the user cannot wait 20 hours to solve a bug problem in Intel or in hardware or failure or in the uh, software also failure so you have to be lean otherwise if you fail then uh, you will lose the trust because time is money therefore we, we need to be lean you have to be fast to fail you have to step ahead from the book and you cannot uh, and uh, uh, f uh, blaming game and uh, you know play the blaming game or play the uh, it's not uh, and other BS is not uh, the answer the answer you have to be lean you have to be fast to solve the problem because uh, otherwise you will lose your users trust if we put in our consideration uh, user central we built software for user or hardware for user not we are building user for our hardware in the end the user is that uh, is at the upper hand and uh, the problem and the bugs that we create in our hardware and software it is not be will never ever be answered by the user it will be have to answer by us so we have to be lean last thing number one number two uh, I, uh, uh, also I think uh, I was thinking here in my proposal uh, we can also uh, create algorithm in this model to check uh, using Python uh, uh, regex uh, uh, transcript uh, text it secret for the URL for each company that uh, have the, that we have the data but uh, have the failure and from this uh, trans uh, transaction we uh, can uh, do something to create uh, a model to so, uh, to show us uh, uh, to give us the the hardware failure code so we don't need to professor or to researcher to uh, to do it manually so we can automate the process and I, it is hard to do it because we have to figure out how to uh, put uh, the uh, we have to play with words and uh, each company they use a different word and uh, we have to think but we can because if we have the technology in 1960 to go to the moon and I'm, sh I'm sure if we work work a little bit harder then we will get uh, we can build algorithm to solve this such kind of, uh, of a problem so until now I arrived to this conclusion and I have uh, to debate my idea with my supervisor uh, in Friday to take uh, to make the takeoff to see where uh, to improve my work or if there's some uh, correction I can correct it and we are learning here so thank you Let's go to see no wrong. so thank you everybody for your attention and uh, see you in my next update stay tuned love and peace